y'all welcome back to my channel it's your girl Mario, also known as soul style beauty and i'm in my new apartment um i moved in on june 27th it's now july 2nd y'all so i still a lot of stuff to like unbox it's still a lot of things to buy and decorate clearly this wall is this is my accent wall for the bedroom it needs like a painting it's not done yet y'all so um yeah the move was really really good besides u-haul and apartment deco i would never ever again just purchase anything from them u-haul played us the day of apartment deco i was preparing for like my dress to get in literally canceled the day of so it's just like certain companies i was just like it literally made the move much harder so i had to reorder a dresser we had to make two trips instead of one for moving so it was a few screw-ups but like thank god everything is like in the apartment it looks good so far today jose is actually coming to set up um our tv stand our console table and our other um shoe stand so it's been really good i'm so thankful y'all and on top of the move on top of just everything else i moved in the day before my birthday so i turned 29 on june 28th um so that was a lot like going from the transition to moving to now my birthday um and then we're about 16 days away from my wedding so <laughs> july and june is just a busy month and then after the wedding is literally his birthday so it's like no breaks in june or july all right y'all so this is my ootd for the day i'm super happy i got this mirror so i can do ootds in my vlogs but i'm just wearing a very basic outfit so get ready for the basics so i have on the top um i got this from h&m and it just says beautiful so i love this shirt i just love the message um and then i have on these jeans from fashion nova and they're really cute um they also have like fringe at the bottom um and that's like the detail that i absolutely love about them and then i have on my supergas <laughs> day but not really um as you guys know like we moved or whatever um but we still are dealing with like the wedding stuff so today we have to actually get a second marriage license for jersey because we actually changed the location of the wedding um so in order to do that which i didn't know you can't have a new york city state like marriage license or new york state marriage license you have to go through um the specific county in jersey so new to me so just in case you guys are preparing it's crazy out here in the street so we definitely have to do that today also the dresser is being delivered today as well so yeah let me show you guys my old td okay so this is the outfit of the day it's pretty chill so i'm wearing like a tank top i got this from like primark a while back and then i'm wearing these um i forgot what these pants culo culo i don't know 
But I'm wearing these type of pants and they're gold and they're pretty. So yeah, this is the outfit for day today. But anyways, let me show you guys what I got. I'm super hyped to try it. Let me see where I can put you guys. Oh, the lighting is really good in this apartment. I'm not mad at it. I don't know where to put y'all. Let me see. Can I build this? <laughs> okay. So that works. So I recently got this all natural hair remover and this is actually called sugar me smooth um body scrub so i'm gonna be trying this later on tonight i'm not gonna try it um now because you know we have the zoom meeting for the new marriage license it's freaking crazy um so i'm gonna try this definitely later with you guys in the bathroom so i hope i don't fail and waste product because this i believe it was like close to 40 like 37 38 still i'm not trying to waste not one lick of product so um yeah it's supposed to be all natural um uh, what does it say two times faster than a wax um than wax more affordable than laser obviously um reuses the same piece of sugar for more uses per jar oh so i like that because i thought that you can just swipe once and pull and throw it out so i'm like this probably won't last me for that long but like i said i'm gonna try it tonight and we all see all right, so we just got done with getting the New Jersey marriage license, and it was totally different than the New York license. I think it was much easier. What do you think? It was it was a shorter process, I'll say. Um, I think the New York one wasn't necessarily a lot more difficult. It was just yeah. longer and drawn out for no reason. Literally. And, like, getting an yeah. appointment... They made it as simple as it should have been in Jersey. Exactly. Like, we called in, we got somebody on the phone, and then we just talked, we sent in the paperwork, and we had a Zoom meeting. For New York, everybody was out of date. Yeah. Like, like the whole process, was, because with COVID and everything happening, like, we couldn't go in person like we normally would. So we had to schedule a virtual appointment. Yeah. But then when we tried to schedule an appointment for it, they had no dates available until August, right? Yeah, it and, wasn't available until August. And so we were getting married in July, so we needed a date before that. And then, so we had to take the August one and email them and ask them for yeah. help. And then the lady responded and she was no help at all. She had no, she didn't even read our email. Right. Anything. And then God came through. But then when we looked at b different like wedding places in New York, they were just rinky dink run down. I know you say they weren't, but they were just. It was too much. So we found a really they nice part. They ideal for our wedding. They weren't just ideal. So we found a place in Jersey, but it just sucks that you have to go through the whole process again of getting like a marriage yeah. license and getting a permit for this actual location. Like it's so different yeah. in New Jersey. So yeah. anyways, I'm about to have, Jose is about to watch The Last Dance. So I'm about to go and juice. So yeah. you said later, I can't. All right, y'all, so I'm about to juice. I am using some kale green, some spinach, some carrots, and I'm gonna put turmeric and ginger. So yeah, y'all, the last time I juiced, I didn't buy enough produce, so I learned my lesson with like, you know, making sure I have enough produce, so we can see. I'm gonna show you guys my blender. So here's my blender. It's okay, it's just okay. I feel like I'm gonna get a new one very soon, probably like in five or six months, but this works. I got this from Amazon, and I wish I would've gotten a better one. I mean, it does the job, but I just feel like I could've gotten a better one, but yep, that's what I'm working with today. Okay, 
Okay, so after juicing, this is all the juice that I got. I know, from all that, <laughs> like, you just get this much. That's the thing, your produce bill does go up. So, this is all the pulp that I have to take out tonight because if you leave it in the garbage, it literally, like, stinks up your kitchen. So, yeah, I'm about to pour this in a jar, and then we'll truly see how much juice we got. So hey y'all, I am back, head tight and all. I had to free myself, y'all. I feel like weight sometimes are like bras. But anyways, I started using this Sugar Me Smooth Sugaring Wax and I really like it. Like I think the pain tolerance is probably like a six out of 10. So it's not that bad. Um, you can use the same sugar for, you know, a few flicks to get your hair off. So it's not like you're constantly using products, um, but I like it. So just jam out to some music, but I'll show you like what the hair looks like. So if that's TMI but I also want to show you guys like there's actual like you know it actually works 